Hi, I'm Michael Besnard. It's officially been one month since the new year has started, and what a perfect time to start the year off, a month late. So I figure, what better way to begin 2018 than to look back at all my old content, explain my absence, and where I'm headed or what I want to do. If you know me, or have been on this channel long enough, you would know that I haven't been good at posting a new video every week, or staying true to my own YouTube schedule. And all of 2017, I didn't really upload anything too grand or new. And why is that? Well, during 2016, I underwent a surgery that basically crippled me for four months. And from there, my illness kept me feeling sick and sore for a very long while. And at the time all this was happening, I was studying animation. I kept going to university even though I had a baseball sized hole in my body. Lots of fun. By the end of 2016 into 2017, I rolled into a depression. My anxiety was and still is my biggest issue. So when it came to creating videos, I couldn't find the energy or would overthink things, or my own thoughts would just bring me down enough to think I was no good or not worth it. So let's go over my content. In 2017, on my gaming channel, I posted 13 videos, four of which were live streams, and nine were just play of the game clips from Overwatch. I'm not touching myself, no. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and on my other channel, I posted three videos, which two are part of a series I like to call Talking with Video Games. I plan to continue this series, but of course to release them more often because four months apart is a bit ridiculous. And in 2016, on my gaming channel, I posted 21 videos. I was trying something new. I hid all my 220 previous videos, and I started a fresh look. I made a four episode series of me making Minecraft weapons inspired by YouTubers. I played UHC with the Craft Theory crew, and I joined their server. I also played some Hitman, Dead by Daylight, and streamed some more. By mid-year, I was finally able to make a trailer for my fresh new look. But while all that was happening, I was still not in a good place mentally. And even when I was still pushing myself to make content while studying, I ended up making a parody of PPAP, which kind of just made me feel not good in myself. After that, I didn't make anything on the channel until the following year. On my other channel, in 2016, I created one video. That has reached over 75,000 views. It's called Dead by Daylight Animation. With the amount of love I've gotten from that video, has now gotten me encouraged to make more like it. It was part of a uni project and didn't take me that long to make. So, I'm going to put more time and effort into my future animations, so keep an eye out for those. 2010 to 2015 was all about me growing up, learning about the internet and about myself. I fell in love with many content creators, and they helped me through some very tough times. I want to entertain and make people happy just like they did for me. Ten years ago, I was just a kid in high school. I loved writing stories, playing video games, and drawing new worlds and characters. Now I'm 23 years old and I still love doing all those things plus more. I want to make it my career and life creating. I'm a creative person at heart, and my passions don't lie with only one thing, which has made it hard for me to choose what paths to take in order to be happy. So I've recently decided to dedicate my time for now to create and produce anything my heart desires and release them to YouTube. I want to inform, inspire, entertain and educate with all my videos here on YouTube. And maybe on the way I can learn more about myself, become less stressed, 
and be truly happy. Thank you for watching.